morning, it is Saturday today and this is day one of being back on Swimming World which feels very very strange but also kind of exciting at the same time. So I'm just leaving Swimming World now after being joining. So today I'm doing what I eat in a day as a newbie but not newbie Swimming World person. So um, I'm really excited for you to follow my journey and I look forward to your support and I shall see you very soon. Take care. Not sure why I did an ending. I'm obviously losing the plot completely, but I'll show you what I have for breakfast in a bit. Got poker chip. Well, it's that one of them you get off games, isn't it? <laughs> Good man. Go down that way, man. I wonder what that was. Is that a sundial or is that a? It's like it used to have. It looks like it used to have a bandstand, but it's been. It's gone missing. Walked off with it in the garden. Looks like they've uh, redone the uh, fencing around it. There's no sundial on it. It's just a. Uh, what used to be Banton. Are you walking down that way then? Uh, Fresh wood, eh? Hello. Walk through the Ford bit, Eddie, if she wants to. Right, Can walk through the waterfall? No, definitely not. She's chasing the ducks instead. And hiding, I know. As long as them swans don't get near me, I'm not bothered. Taz is just there, isn't it? It is. I see one there.
Right, no, thank you. I don't think no. she should be drinking it though. <laughs> Not like that other doggy. That other doggy went in it. You're walking back over that bridge there? Or do you want to walk round? I don't know how much time we've got. Hi, it's five past five. I'm just back picking you up from work and uh, not much to report on. I showed you what I had to eat. <coughs> Sorry, coughing. Um, they didn't have any jacket potatoes. They had nothing that I could immediately think that was similar friendly. The closest I could get was the roll. They did have salads, but they were Caesar salad that had aioli and stuff on it that was homemade. So I think it would have been high in calories and no doubt lots of other cheese and stuff. So um, I didn't go for the salad. It was also £8.50. If you wanted chicken on top, it was another £5. I just thought it was a bit pricey. So I had a ham roll and then I had a beef roll and we went halves on it. Sorry if this looks a little bit cut up. I'm trying to cut my coughs out. Um, so yeah, so I said in my weighing update that I might consider it to be my healthy extra B today. Today is my first day on plan. Well, just rejoining and I haven't got all the foods in yet and I'm not, I haven't read all the information so I think I need to be fair to myself today and give myself a bit of flexibility on my first day back I could count it as nine sins which I think a white roll would be or I could count it as my healthy extra B and three sins which I think I probably will do I won't count it as my healthy extra B I think I'll count it as a healthy extra B and three sins just to cover myself um, it wasn't a huge roll and I don't think it was you know I don't it wasn't like a brioche roll or anything it was just a standard sort of like homemade white roll so I'm sure it would be okay and um, was definitely the healthiest option that was available so I feel fine with that I didn't have any breakfast that's all I've had so far and it's now five o'clock so I'm not sure what I'm gonna have tea I was hoping to be able to go through all my magazines and stuff and um, go food shopping prior to coming to pick you and up but that I just haven't had a chance I've been through my books I'm still trying to equate myself with everything. I need to go through the magazine and then decide on what I'm making for the tea this week. See what I've got in the freezer that I can use up and see what I need to buy. I know I definitely need to get salad and fruit and veg because I haven't got anything really in, in that sort of area. So I'm currently thinking if I can't get it tonight, I might have to go tomorrow. I'm going to a craft fair with Chloe at 10 in the morning. So hopefully I could pop to the supermarket after that on my way home and get some bits so that might be the best option I think unless I get a chance to pop out this, this evening but like I said in my other video unless you get out early doors there's not always much left in the way of fruit and veg and I want to start the week properly so uh, so yeah I don't know what I'm gonna do yet we shall see um, tea wise I know I have got mints in and I think I might have pasta in so I could do like a cheeseburger pasta bowl something like that that I know is um, fairly good from a sin point of view just can see people walking around and if you see me talking to myself I look like a crazy person I really wish this cough and cold would do one but it's still it's persevering and staying around um, hope you're all having a good day bank holiday weekend and I feel quite focused so let's hope this continues for the week I'm sure it will I feel quite sort of like happy at the moment oh he's shutting one of the gates um, I thought I was getting locked in for a minute and uh, yeah, I need to do some exercise. I've done probably about 5,000 steps around Ashbourne today. So not as many as what you think. You go for these sort of like walks around places and you think you're getting your steps in, but actually it's not nearly enough. So whether I try and get out for another walk before the end of the day, I just don't think I'm gonna have time. If I go food shopping, I suppose I might get some extra steps in. So that's me, I'm gonna go now. And um, I think Ewan's on his way out, but if not, I'm just gonna sit and watch a bit of TikTok for a few minutes and I shall catch you in a bit next time. Perhaps I'm prepping dinner and see you in a bit. Evening, we've been down to visit Eddie's mum and we popped to um, Tesco on the way back just to get something in for tea. Haven't done my complete shopping list yet, so I haven't done a full shop, but I'll quickly show you what we're having. So I was excited to find out that it's changed since I last was a Slim World member and now fresh pasta that's plain is free. So we are having tagliatelle, so Eddie and I will share this bag between us. Um, so that's sin free. I've got some Mediterranean vegetables to roast. They're sin free as well. I've checked that in the app. I've got some arabiata sauce. Normally I would make my own, but it is ten, five to nine. So I'm just gonna have this. Um, this is eight sins for the whole pot. So four sins for my half. And I'm gonna cook some chicken up as well. So there'll be plenty of speed um, 
obviously that's four sins, free and free. So I'm looking forward to this because I'm absolutely starving. And as this is only four sins, I will count the bread roll earlier as four sins, which means I haven't had my healthy extra B and I don't know if I'm gonna end up having it because I don't think I'm gonna be able to fit it in today, which is a bit naughty really. But there's nothing more I can do because um, I'm eating so late, so I doubt very much I'm gonna to want to have anything else to eat and I haven't got the right sort of bread in. I did look in Tesco to see if they had any bagels for the morning. They didn't have the right sort of bagels, they didn't have the right sort of thins, so um, I didn't bother looking at the bread because they hadn't got much in at all. So I'm just gonna to have to get some tomorrow, hopefully. Um, I need to just familiarize myself with which ones are free or well, healthy extra bees and which ones aren't. So I need to go through and, and have a good look. I'm gonna get this dinner on now and I'll show you when I've dished it out. Here is my evening meal. So I've got quite a lot of the roasted Mediterranean veg, which I think is all speed. I think the courgette speed, I need to check that. But the peppers, onions and tomatoes, I'm fairly confident are all speed. <laughs> Still getting back into this. Um, I've got the tagliatelle. Now we have actually got, I haven't got half a pack. Um, I've left some in the container. I've just literally filled that part of my plate with it with some of the tomato sauce on. So I probably haven't had the four sins I've counted, but that's fine. And then I've just got some chicken over here and I have counted, um, I think I counted a half a sin for the garlic and herb seasoning. It was actually, I think a sin for a whole tablespoon. I only put a half a tablespoon over all of the meat, which covered for, for me and Eddie and there's two pieces left. So I've more than covered my sins for today. The Parmesan I'm casting has been my healthy extra A. Um, I have done really badly today on healthy extra A's. I've had black coffee when we were out. I haven't had that many um, drinks today of tea or anything, so I've done pretty bad from a drink point of view. But I haven't had a huge amount of healthy extra A. So I've probably only had one overall because that, that Parmesan didn't even weigh. It's hardly anything there. But I'm going to count that as a healthy extra A gone for the day with my milk and with that. Um, I've counted everything else now in the app with sins and things. So I've counted the whole bread roll as a sin as sins for... Um, nine sins and then obviously I've counted all of the sauce even though I haven't had half of it so I think I'm finishing on 13 and a half sins for the day which I'm happy with because it was never going to be you know the best of days because obviously I haven't been shopping yet and I'm just getting my, myself back into it I could actually have just said I'm leaving it till tomorrow but I decided no I need to start straight away so I'm quite happy with how today's gone I won't be having anything else to eat after this so this will be me done for today and I shall catch you tomorrow oh and I just wanted to say um, thank you for all your messages of support on my last video where I told you I'd been back to Simming World. Um, lots and lots of messages of support, so I really appreciate it. And I will be reaching out if I need any help getting my head back, back round and back into the game. Um, but yeah, feeling quite motivated at the moment and I shall catch you again tomorrow. That's what I ordered a full breakfast but I gave Chloe and Ethan my sausages and my fried potatoes. I did eat the sourdough bread but I didn't have the butter and I think the mushrooms had a little bit of oil on but not a huge amount so I think it was okay. It's Sunday and I haven't vlogged today yet apart from um, I went into Derby and I went to the Craft and Flea show. I didn't film anything in there because it was really rammed and really tightly packed together and to be honest with my height you would have just got loads of people you wouldn't have actually be able to see anything anyway so i decided not to bother vlog i did film my breakfast so we decided to have breakfast beforehand it was just chloe myself and ethan sorry the lighting's not very good if i go that way um and i ordered the derby breakfast but i gave those two my sausages and my fried potatoes i do think the mushrooms were cooked in a little bit of oil because they were I just felt, felt like they might have been, they didn't taste particularly fried, but I'm going to count a bit of oil as sins just to safeguard my weight loss, but the rest of it was free because it was bacon, I made sure there was no fat on it, I had beans, I had poached eggs, there was a slice of sourdough bread which I'm going to have to count as sins because I don't think it'll be a healthy extra A, didn't have any butter on it, left the butter behind and just had that on my breakfast, so I think it was the best choice I could make because I didn't have anything else really that that would have been healthier. They did have a vegetarian breakfast, but I'm not sure what the vegetarian sausages were. And it had halloumi and stuff on it, so I just thought, I'll, I'll just stick with the what, what I know is free. Um, we had a wander around Derby after the Craftly, just, just went through Primark and stuff. Um, I just feel absolutely shattered. I don't know if it's just the whole week catching up with me or if it's just the remains of this virus doing 
things to my body but I've just been and done a full food shop from Aldi and I was going to record a haul but I am just so tired and I just want to get it put away and get my dinner put on. So today for dinner we're having roast beef and I've got vegetables so it should be all relatively speed and free and protein apart from obviously the potatoes, I've had potatoes on there and a bit of gravy so it should all be okay. <clears throat> I have got some fruit that I bought in Aldi that was all reduced, some blackberries and strawberries and things so I'm probably going to do some sort of eaten mess later but I just need to work my sins out because obviously I had the sourdough bread so I don't know how much damage that's done so I just need to work out what I've got left and see if I've got enough to have an eaten mess if not it would just be probably a kvark because I think that's half a cent with some fruit so I'm sure I'll have enough for that so yeah early days in getting back into it for me um and obviously I hadn't been food shopping up until this point so I've bought lots of like chicken breasts five percent fat beef so I know I can make plenty of food. I've bought rice and pasta and all the sort of staples that you normally have when you're on Slimming World. I did sit and try and do a bit of meal planning, but to be honest with you, I wasn't terribly successful. I need to really sort of sit down and go through my recipe books and things, but I know that there's plenty of stuff I can make with the things I've bought, so it's absolutely fine. Um, I'm gonna have a cup of tea, put my shopping away and get my beef put on. I was supposed to be nipping over to my sister's after four, but to be honest, I don't think my dinner's gonna be cooked by then. So it might have to be a bit later if I go at all, but to be honest, I feel like I need a nana nap. <laughs> I'm really, really tired. So um, lots of body magic. So I've done lots of like lifting and movement and things with shopping and all the rest of it. Um, so yeah, not much else to report on really. Um, I'll show you when I get my dinner out next. Won't be doing anything exciting in between times. And um, we do need to try and take Luna out for a quick walk, but it's a bit murky over here and a bit grey and miserable. So I don't know how much she'll want to. I think she's just been sitting next to Eddie on the sofa, watching TV all day so far. So. So yeah, that's uh, that's my day so far, and uh, I shall catch you in a bit for my dinner. Here's my Sunday dinner. So I've got roast beef, and this is really lean, there's no fat on it at all. I've got uh, roast potatoes that have been done with spray oil in the active fry. I've got broccoli for speed, green beans for speed, and carrots for speed. And I've got some normal boiled potatoes with nothing else on them. I've got a Yorkshire pudding. This is two sins. They used to be one and a half last time I did some more, but it looks like they're scanning at two at the moment. And there is some gravy over the top. I've only got 50 mils of gravy, so that's one sin. So three and... Three sins for dinner. <laughs> I had to work it out then. Two sins, three sins for dinner. Everything else is a mixture of um, speed, protein, and free. Uh, I need to work out, just double check what I'm on... Um, sim wise to see whether I can have some pudding but if I can't have anything else I'll just have a kvog and some fruit so I shall catch you in a bit oh, bluebells ready there's a bluebell That's off the bluebells. Yeah. See the bluebells or daffodils. Which yeah. way are you going? That way or that way? Got them so out of breath. Here is my pudding or supper, however you want to call it. So I've weighed out 75 grams of the white chocolate kvog and that is half a sin. And I've got um, a heap of strawberries on there. And then I've got three of these little moon meringues from Aldi that I saw on Hay Bale's channel. So I'm a little bit confused because on it it says three of them are 32 calories. But in the app they come up as half a sin per meringue which seems quite a lot, so I've got three, so that'd be one and a half sins. One and a half sins for 32 calories. Doesn't seem quite right, because normally it's about 20 calories per sin, isn't it? But um, I don't know. I've just put it in exactly how it is, and I think I'm finishing on about 11 and a half sins today. 
I'll update the screen with the accurate amount, but that'll be me done for today. So I'm not hungry hungry, but I'm a bit peckish, so I just thought I might as well have something because that's why I bought them, so that I'm not feeling deprived or hungry. I actually made a syrup sponge for everyone else, um, and I didn't have any, but syrup sponge is one of my favourite things, so I've done quite well really to say no to that. So I'm going to go eat this, and I shall catch you tomorrow. See you soon. Bye.